tell us, what do you think you bring to American Idol? Your role has sort of been an addition the past year. Um, yeah, so for me, you know, they brought me on the last three seasons to work with the contestants, anything from um, singing, because I'm a musician, or stage presence, um, a comedian, or even like life coaching, because I come from pretty humble humble beginnings like a lot of the contestants do here. And so I, I think at first they brought me on for one episode, and that kind of rolled into, here we are three seasons later, uh, still at it. So, you know, I think it's a little bit of everything. In my career from doing radio to music, comedy, or even books, you know, there's something that I can give them in some way. And, you know, in a lot of ways I work with every contestant differently. So that's what I'm here to do. Yeah, that's what I try to explain to people. You're a motivator. You really push people uh, out of their comfort zone. What's it like to be that person? Well, I never set out to be that person. I just, um, I, I see a lot of potential in people maybe when they don't see it themselves because I think people saw it in me when I didn't see it in me as well. And so, you know, working with them and actually talking to them about, you know, what happens if it goes well? What happens if it doesn't go well? The sun still comes up the next day. Are you going to get back up and keep going or are you going to quit? And I think a lot of that affects um, how you will go into a performance like this. And so for me, you know, I don't know that I'm here trying to inspire. I'm just trying to, you know, be be a realist with them. Like, either way, you're still all right and you're pretty blessed. And so, you know, let's see how we approach this right this second. So it's been fun for me to kind of work with them day to day and, and stay through the season with them as well and to grow with them. Again, this is my third season of being on the show. So it's been great to really, you know, forge these relationships. You know, I have two of the contestants from last season on tour with me right now in Walker Burroughs and Emma Klein. And so I've been able to continue the mentorship and actually pay them too, which has been pretty cool. Yeah, that's a good segue. I mean, you're on the radio, you do this, you do, you know, your music. How do you do it all? Well, I think I'm just scared. I'm scared I'm going to be broke again. So uh, I just got to keep working. Um, I, you know, I just really enjoy a lot of things. And I've been blessed enough to, you know, have people that come out to shows and, um, you know, played in Madison a few times. They're, it's just the greatest crowd. It's the one place that I crowd surfed on my stomach, which you should never do. I didn't know you shouldn't do that. And it was at the Orpheum that I jumped on my stomach and, and I was like, oh, this is not a good idea. And we have a video of that in Madison. It's my one true stupid moment on stage. Um, but for me, you know, it, th to be able to create and, and, and pay the water bill, like that's, that's pretty cool. So, um, and to be able to give back to a lot of these contestants on American Idol and hopefully give them some advice to help them just progress to the next step, that's a goal. Yeah. Uh, how's the talent this season? I think it's all right. I mean, we're learning. It's just, you know, Madison's our, 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 we're in Milwaukee. Milwaukee's only our second stop so far. Um, we spent some time in Georgia. It was really good. You see a different kind of artist in all parts of the country, though. You know, there were a lot of country artists down in Georgia. And, you know, Milwaukee here, you know, you're getting a, a, a kind of a grab bag because, you know, the Midwest has so many influences musically. Um, so it's always interesting to see the, the general style of the artist more than it is the talent because you get some that are great, some that are okay. You know, I think that's always the case. But I think you're seeing more original uh, artists come up and play, people that are doing their own songs. And to me, that's pretty cool to see people coming up that are songwriters playing and actually getting through. There are a lot of uh, different talent shows on TV right now. What does American Idol bring that the others don't? Well, American Idol brings the fact that we're in Milwaukee. Like, the other shows, whatever they are, I've never heard of any other show except this one, by the way. Um, <laughs> the other shows, they don't go into the cities of America to find the best talent. Like, someone like myself, I would have never have had the money to fly out to Los Angeles and try out for a show. You know, American Idol, we were in Savannah, Georgia last week. We're in Milwaukee this week. We're going to D.C. We're going to Portland, near Portland. So, for us, we want to get out to where we can actually find the best talent because not everyone has the resources to get a plane ticket in a hotel and, and, and cross their fingers and hope to make it. So Idol is about being inside of America and, and, and trying to find the next, well, American Idol.